Oh my god! Hey guys, Sasha here, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here, and welcome to another Taeyeon reaction. We're only, uh, like, we're less than two weeks away from Taeyeon's new album release, her third full album, I Envy You. Um, I'm super excited for it, the teasers look stunning. Um, I love the overall concept from what we've seen so far. Um, obviously I love Can't Control Myself, such an amazing song, fantastic MV. If you've not seen my reaction, check it out, it's on my channel. Um, but today, uh, I want to complete something <laughs> that I really feel the need to complete before uh, I listen to Taeyeon's new album. Um, and that is, like, her first full album. Um, my voice, because I've never listened to it. Um, I've heard certain songs, um, obviously from my MV reactions, but I really felt the need to listen to her first album uh, after uh, Loving Purpose, her second album, so much. I even got that one. I think it's my probably my favorite K-pop album that I've listened to so far. Um, and it's very hard to surpass. <laughs> I don't know how any album could surpass Purpose, but the great thing about Taeyeon is that um, she always finds a way to do things differently, like not better, but in a different way that is just as good. So uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to her first album and then in a few weeks her third full album. Um, so yeah, uh, my voice has 16 songs um, talking about the deluxe edition um, and I've already heard four of them. I've already heard Make Me Love You, I've already heard Fine, um, I've already heard I Got Love and then I've already heard 11-11. Uh, um, I might have heard snippets of other songs as well from reacting to certain live compilations of Taeyeon um, but I don't think I've ever heard the full song or like with lyrics, so um, I'm gonna check out 12 B-sides. Uh, there will be at least two parts, depending on how much SM will allow me to post. So um, probably there will be two parts with six songs each. If not, there will probably be three parts with four songs each. We will see. <laughs> this was part one. And yeah, I'm very excited, so let's not waste any time. Let's get right into Taeyeon's first full album, My Voice. Let's go. And we're gonna start with the first song, which is Cover Up in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> song that reminds me of Red Velvet style, like it's like the, the typical summer songs they, they do. This is giving me similar vibes and I love it. Oh, this is so wild! 
Town has a song like this. Oh. Oh, I mean it too. <laughs> oh, you hear that? Oh, it's so I hear such a upbeat dance track from her since the Y mini album. I love it. We started with a light bubbly dance song like this this was a lot of fun I was not expecting this like um, based on the first two songs that we skipped make me love you and fine they're quite emotional and like more low-key and this is like totally different and I love it so much that was really cool Still recording. Okay, next song. Feels so fine. I feel like I have heard parts of the song. I think I've heard parts of the live stage of this. Ooh. Oh my god! those vocals. I mean, it's a given with Taeyeon, but whenever that power comes through, I love it.
god, she's so positive, so uplifting. It's beautiful. Wow. Yeah. Talent's power, Talent's like, the emotion she brings into her, her vocals will always get me. And then this, this, this song, this chorus, the lyrics, ah, that was fantastic. I love this song a lot. It's very, very different from Cover Up, but yeah, like, ah, oh, damn. So, uh, we've already heard I Got Love, so we're gonna go right to the next one, which is I'm Okay. I guess. Okay, never mind. I, I, was, I wanted to say this is a ballad, but. This feels sassy. after this but <laughs> what I wanted to say uh, before that incredible bridge set in 
Do you know the feeling when you when you're just listening to your song and then you realize, oh my god, this is one of my new favorites? Like you just you instantly become obsessed with the song while listening to it. This is exactly how I felt about this song. I can already tell this will definitely be in my top three of this album. And I'm only saying top three because you never know, Taeyeon. <laughs> Maybe she's releasing another one of these bangers on this album, but this is a strong contender for favorite song overall on this album. Oh my god. Okay, next song is Time Lapse. I feel like I've heard parts of this song on the live stage as well. Was it part of the top 12 emotional singing moments? Maybe? Wait, let me start over. It's interesting. Interesting instrument in the background. I'm not talking about the guitar, but then. That transition was beautiful. Wow, this is one of the softest I've ever heard Taeyeon sing. that they didn't have the same tempo. My time of ballad. You keep making me cry. That's honestly how I feel whenever I listen to our B-sides. Wow, the switch of the transitions in this song. It's so rare for a ballad.
second I thought they brought in the choir wow that instrumental is so beautiful and I think the strongest part about this song is what What's the hardest part about ballads, at least for me, it's to keep them interesting, to keep me invested, like... It can be perfectly sung and emotional, but if it's keeping the same melody, the same tempo throughout, after like four minutes, it can get boring, at least for me. Uh, that's how I feel about certain ballads when I listen to them more often. This song is, is, oh, this is pretty unique. I don't think I've heard a ballad type song. I don't, I don't know if you can, is this a ballad even? Like, I'm not sure, but it has so many switch ups and great uh, transitions musically that, that it makes it so interesting and, and you're invested the whole time. Obviously, Taeyeon popping off with those vocals, but um, what really stood out to me here was was the whole construction of this song. It was really interesting, and I'm no expert, but that was just really fun to listen to. Next song, Sweet Love. Ooh. Oh, I love that kind of the kind of retro effect they put on her voice to make it. Like she 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 sounds like on these old radios when they're You got me. Wow. I love that. I love that phrase. Beach, other source of light. I love that. Drunk on the sweetness. Give me your sweet love. Wow. It's kind of cute. <laughs> Did not expect this when it started. Am I the only one who realized that she kind of often uses this this image of flying in her songs? Like, um, we got it here, we got it in um, Cover Up, I think we got it in as, at least like two songs on purpose as well. Uh, it's really interesting. I love this part. I love how she goes from higher, and then the, the 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 next line is so sweet. Yes. 
was actually pre pretty cute, pretty fun, but still very powerful. Okay, next, when I was young. What I was talking about with time lapse, like this is like the textbook type of ballad, and we're like one third into the song, and even though it's very beautiful, like I need I need a switch up. Like it's not bad, but it's very calm and very much in the same type of manner throughout. like it's building up to something really big. I hope I'm right. you to say like remember it it was beautiful we were young 
and fools and naive but hey it was nice to remember right um, that's the the vibe the song was giving me um, it's a nice ballad it is beautifully sung by Taeyeon um, but it's not my favorite like I, I think she has better ballads that are just more interesting like time lapse for example um, but yeah there was that was really cool. That was part one of our little listening party of my voice. I loved it a lot. I miss listening to new Tangon music, to new Tangon B-sides for me. Um, my absolute favorite has to be I'm OK. Um, that song is so amazingly good. I love Cover Up, I love Feel So Fine, Time Lapse, Sweet Love, When I Was Young, but I'm okay. I'm okay is my number one. <laughs> and a strong contender to stay number one even after part two. Um, but yeah guys, let me know um, what are your favorites from these songs so far. And yeah, uh, look out for part two. I'll try to record it right away and try to upload them relatively close to each other so you don't have to wait. Um, but yeah, that was part one. See you on part two. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you want to, and as always, see you all next time, and auf Wiedersehen!